Yeah. So, if you got a rose for Valentine's Day, and you're in Saudi Arabia, you're going to jail, motherfucker. <laughs> Yeah, so Saudi Arabia apparently wants to put a ban on Valentine's Day. Not only that, anything red on Valentine's Day. And they are enforcing it. They are actually arresting people. Uh, the, the Red Rose Market has gone underground. This is true. You gotta check out the links in the description. But the, the Red Rose Market has gone underground uh, delivering roses at night and their uh, black market roses at that because they can't be legally imported uh, to Saudi Arabia. And of course, it's a fucking desert so they don't have any sand to like grow anything. So, you know, all they got is oil and money. Rethink buying an electric car next year, why don't you? And in other news, while I was doing this research for, for this story, because I heard it on NPR this morning, and uh, that's National Public Radio in, in America, and uh, I heard it on there this morning about the roses in Saudi Arabia. So all I did was I, I Google typed Fatwa and Valentine and came up with, actually there's quite, quite a few. Just about every Islamic country has some sort of Fatwa against uh, celebrating Valentine's Day. Now, granted, it's St. Valentine's Day, it's a Catholic kind of holiday thing, but it's much like Christmas or Easter, it's a commercial holiday. It, it means the, 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 the religious aspects have pretty much been stripped from it, and, and it's been stripped a long, long time ago on Valentine's Day, uh, as far as that goes. Um, and so what's what I find interesting is that you know all these Islamic countries have fatwas against basically a secular holiday uh, saying many of them stating that it incites passion and romance and love and the God of love Allah a God of peace and love, Allah, would not appreciate a day celebrating love. You know, just when you think religious people can't get any more nut job, they they, they do it. They do it. They go, huh, there's the land. Uh, there's the line in the sand. I'm going to jump way over there. Ha, ha, ha. Yeah, fuck you, atheists. I'm going crazy. Woohoo. And off they go down to crazy land. And on a personal note, um, I'd just like to say that uh, me and my girlfriend... Uh, and she is still my girlfriend. I call her my wife, but she really is my girlfriend, fiance, whatever you want to call her. Uh, never really celebrate uh, Valentine's Day or, for that matter, Christmas much. We love to put up lights and stuff for Christmas, but we don't really celebrate anything other than that. Um, and this year was the first year in years that we got each other any kind of gifts. Uh, because we just don't celebrate that kind of stuff as, as atheists and just didn't miss it or didn't feel left out of it or whatever but uh, on this Valentine's Day I'd like to say Beth I love you more every day and uh, it's been it'll be 10 years this October and uh, I don't regret a minute of it and I look forward to the next 10 years and hopefully uh, many more years and uh, just wanted you to know that oh I don't even know if this shit will make it in the video oh.